This is Mike Scott, the film critic at the Times Picayune in New Orleans. And if you go see just one movie this weekend, this is the one. This week, Smart People, a smartly directed slice of life dramatic comedy telling the story of a heartbroken family trying to put itself back together again. It's a well cast film, with the always earnest Dennis Quaid starring as the crusty and curmudgeonly widower who's been left broken and rudderless by the years old death of his wife. Sarah Jessica Parker, who we'll see again next month in the more mainstream Sex in the City movie, is an emergency room doctor who just might be the person who can revive him. And they're joined here by Ellen Page, fresh off her Oscar nomination for her role in last year's sweetheart surprise, Juno. Page's character in Smart People exhibits a lot of June Bug's droll outlook and some of her vulnerability, too, but this isn't the same character. For one, Juno's flip attitude is replaced with a must-ace-the-SAT's determination. For another, the poster of Iggy Pop and the Stooges on Juno's bedroom wall is replaced with a portrait of Ronald Reagan. What's no different, though, is Paige's ability to charm audiences. She, Quaid, and Parker would appear to be the smart people in the title, but Thomas Hayden Church, as Quaid's happily hapless brother, might be the smartest of them all. With his uncomplicated perspective, he's the sole character in the film who appears truly happy with his life, putting him in the perfect position to offer a little brotherly wisdom. Smart People was directed by Noam Murrow, and his film isn't for impatient audiences. And what that means is you're going to find no woolly mammoth hunts here, no old-school football sequences, no high-stakes blackjack games. What it does have, however, is a hard-to-resist charm. It's a sweet little film. One that's difficult to resist and easy to get caught up in. And this week, it's also the one.